How are you doing? Hope you are doing well. Today we will calculate the PCC quantity for these foundations. In the last video we have calculated the total excavation for the foundations. So without wasting any time, let's get started and calculate the PCC for all foundations and also the material for PCC quantity like cement, sand, aggregate and also the water let's quantity. Let's calculate the PCC quantity for all foundations. PCC calculation per foundations. We know from the driving the the footing size is the size of the footing is 2.4 meter and the other size is also 2.4 meter. The PCC that we provide under the foundations, the height of the PCC will be 10 centimeter. So now we will calculate the PCC for the foundations. We know the William formula for the foundation is A square times H. Here A is the both side of the square foundations. We know it is 2.4 meter. And H, and H is the height of the PCC which is 10 centimeter. 10 centimeter or it equals to 0.1 meter. Now we will put this value in the formula and we will get the PCC volume per one foundation. 2.4 square times H.1 It equals to 0.576 cubic meter. So this is only the one foundation quantity. So we will multiply this volume with the all foundations so we will get the total PCC quantity for the foundations. Total PCC volume number of foundations foundations times one foundation one foundation quantity. So we know the the total PCC volume will equal to the number of foundations which is 17 foundations we know from the driving we have 17 foundations in our project building times the one foundation quantity one foundation quantity is 0.576 cubic meter which equals to 9792 cubic meter the all pcc that we will provide for the all foundations will be 9.792 cubic meter so this is only wet concrete. We will change the wet concrete to dry concrete. We have the coefficient for that is 1.52 and we will multiply this value in the wet concrete and we will get the dry volume of the concrete. So total total net concrete equals to net or uh, we can say total net PCC equals to 1.5 Five two times nine seven nine two, which equals to to the total PCC equals to. Now uh, we will calculate the material for this quantity of PCC, like cement, sand, rag, and aggregate. Also water for this quantity of PCC. Normally for PCC. We use the mark 15. If you want to know more about the grades of concrete or marks, uh, so you just watch my the previous video and you will know the grades of concrete. We will pretend the mark is M15. For M15, the cement, sand, and aggregate ratio is 1, 2, and 4. Now, let's calculate the cement quantity. Uh, in that quantity of PCC. Cement equals to total PCC volume volume divided by summation summation of ratio times percentage percentage of ratio here in this formula the total volume 
equals to uh, we calculated the total PCC volume is 15.08 cubic meter and summation of the ratio will equals we know the percentage of every material is 1 plus 2 plus 4 which equals to 7 and the percentage of ratio it means that it shows the every ratio per the different materials like per cement, sand and aggregate per cement the percentage of ratio is 1 now we will put these volumes in this formula and we will get the cement quantity cement equals to total PCC volume which is 15.08 cubic meter divided by summation of the ratio which is 7 times the percentage of ratio which is 1 so we will get the quantity of cement 2.15 cubic meter so the cement quantity equals to 2.215 cubic meter now to calculate the number of bigs how many bigs will be required per this amount or per this quantity of PCC we know that uh, gamma C or the density of cement is equal to 1440 kg per cubic meter and one and one big is equal to 50 kg we will calculate the one big volume and then we will divide the total volume by one big so we will get the number of the bags so now to calculate one big volume 15 kg divided by 1440 kg cubic meter now kg will cancel with kg and we will get which will approximately equal to 0 0.035 cubic meter so this is the volume of one bag to calculate the number of bags number of bags we will divide the total volume by one big volume total volume divided by one big volume so total volume is 2.15 or 2.15 divided by 0.035 so it will equal to 61.4 it, it almost equals to 62 bigs so cement equals to 62 bigs I will show you another short way for calculating the number of bags that once we find the volume of the cement from the quantity of PCC we will multiply the quantity of the density of the cement which is 1440 kg per cubic meter number of bags equals to volume of this is another short way volume of cement times gamma C so number of bags volume of PCC is 2.15 times 1440 kg per cubic meter so we will multiply this which equals to 3081.6 kg now we know the one big weight is 50 kg we will divide the total weight of the cement by one big weight so 3000 3081.6 divided by one big which equals to 61.6 it's almost 62 bags we will calculate the cent quantity cent equals to we have the same formula percent too just we write cent here the total volume of PCC divided by summation of the ratio and here percentage of cent which is 2 total PCC volume is 15.08 divided by 7 times 2 
4.3 cubic meter. This is the volume absent and also we will calculate the aggregate quantity. Aggregate quantity. It also has the same formula. Here we will write aggregate and we will put the percentage of ratio here the aggregate which is both. 15.08 divided by 7 times 4. We will get the volume 8.6 cubic meter. Let's calculate the water quantity per the amount of PCC. Water equals to in the last video we discussed water cement ratio. So that video was really important. If you didn't watch that video, please first watch that video to understand the water cement ratio per M15 per M15 62 liters are required, which is per one big R per 50 kg. We also taught in that video that water cement ratio should be smaller than or equal to 0.6 greater than or equal 0.3. From the construction side per M15 per 1 kg or per 1 bag 32 liters are required. Now so per 1 kg it is 32 liters we have the total weight of the uh, cement that we calculate uh, is 3081 kg so per 50 kg 32 liters are required how many liters will be required per 3081 so we will calculate the x from here x equals to nineteen seventy one point eight liters so this is the water quantity per that amount of PCC. If we calculate from this formula, let's see how many liters we will get. If we pretend the water cement ratio equals to 0.6, now we know the cement weight is 3081 kg. Now we will put this value in the formula, we will get the water 0.6 time 3081 that will equal to you can see here we calculate from this formula and also from the um, construction site experiment and we how the water liters from both way so this was the PCC calculation for the foundations and also the material calculation like cement sand and uh, aggregate also the water quantity per that amount of PCC. See, so thank you very much. See you in the next video. Tata Karnataka.